Welcome to our channel. What color is Jupiter? Firstly, the color of Jupiter changes with storms and wind. In its atmosphere, white spots indicate cool storms, brown spots indicate warm storms and red spots indicate hot storms. Secondly, Jupiter's outer atmosphere is made up of mostly hydrogen and helium, with small amounts of other elements like water droplets, ice crist, and ammonia crystals. When these elements form clouds, they create shades of white, orange, brown, and red. Why are some planets called terrestrial? The word terrestrial comes from the Latin word terra, which means Earth. Terrestrial planets are made of rocks and metals and have a central metallic core surrounded by a mantle of silt delicate rocks and minerals. The mantle is usually the largest part of the planet by volume terrestrial planets also have landforms like cliffs, valleys, volcanoes, and craters. The four terrestrial planets in our solar system are the four innermost planets Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. Uh, why is Mercury not Tully locked? Mercury is not Tully locked to the Sun because it is in a 3x2 orbital resonance. This means that Mercury rotates three times on its axis for every two orbits it makes around the Sun. This prevents Mercury from being locked in a single face towards the Sun. The reason for this is Mercury's elliptical orbit around the Sun. This orbit causes its speed to vary significantly, thus preventing it from being fully tidally locked. Why is Jupiter called a failed star? To start with, Jupiter is made up of hydrogen and helium, the same elements as our Sun but it is not massive enough to create the internal pressure and temperature needed to fuse hydrogen into helium. Basically, Jupiter would need to be about 75 times more massive to ignite nuclear fusion in its core. Hence, Jupiter is called a failed star because it has the same ingredients as a star, but didn't grow massive enough to ignite. Why is Mars a dead planet? Firstly, Mars is core cooled and solidified too quickly causing it to lose its magnetic field. Secondly, without a magnetic field, the solar wind stripped away Mars's atmosphere. Thirdly, without an atmosphere, the water on Mars's surface completely evaporated. Lastly, as most of Mars's volcanic and tectonic activity occurred over 3 billion years ago, it is considered a dead planet now. Huh? Why is Mars's atmosphere so thin? The first reason is Mars's low gravity. As a result, Mars is not able to retain gases. They easily escape into space. The second reason is the lack of a strong magnetic field. This leaves Mars's atmosphere vulnerable to the solar wind. The solar wind is a constant stream of charged particles from the sun that gradually remove Mars's atmospheric gases into space. Why doesn't Earth have Saturn-like rings? Earth doesn't deserve those rings. Only a man does Osam. It's got to do with rotation limit. It is the distance at which objects tend to be ripped apart by the planet's gravitational pull now in case of Saturn. It is popularly believed that a celestial body like Moon or Comet got too close to it and exceeded the Roach limit. Hence, it got ripped apart into pieces, thus forming its rings now Earth-Earth also has a Moon. But since it is beyond the Roach limit, it doesn't get ripped apart into pieces to form rings. Why does Saturn have rings? No big deal. Mum's rings are bigger. Oh, oh mum. One theory suggests that Saturn's rings are remnants of celestial bodies like a moon or a comet billions of years ago. A celestial body may have got too close to Saturn. Hence, the side facing Saturn was pulled more strongly as compared to the side facing away. So this inconsistent gravitational pull may have ripped apart the celestial body into pieces. Finally, these pieces might have started revolving around Saturn, thus forming its beautiful rings. Why is Mars red in color simple? Because I painted it red a home. Mars actually has many colors on its surface. We can see many different colors like brown gold, ick then. Why does Mars appear reddish? The simple reason is that the Martian rock soil as well as dust contain a lot of iron. This iron reacts with the atmospheric oxygen and forms iron oxide. Now the huge dust storms on Mars kick the soil as well as the dust into the atmosphere. Thus from a distance, Mars appears red in color. What if Earth started dancing? So what Omsum is the best dancer Osum firstly? If Earth started dancing humans will not be able to stand still anymore.